Hey everyone, it's Jake from Westcott, and today we're going to go over how to set up the Westcott Easy Boom. Unpack all items from the box and place them on a flat surface. Do not mount the Easy Boom onto a C-stand until assembly is finished. Find the extension arm and carefully insert the bolt into the front support bar of the Easy Boom. Attach the cone-shaped spacer onto the bolt, ensuring the larger end is against the vertical support bar. Slide the included washer onto the cone-shaped spacer. Secure the extension arm to the support bar by fastening the tension knob onto the bolt and rotating it clockwise until snug. Do not over-tighten. Lay the Easy Boom horizontally on a flat surface. Attach the locking pin by pressing the button on the pin and inserting it through the center column in the half circle shaped support plate. Ensure the locking pin is fully inserted and its head is flush with the support plate. Remove all equipment and counterweights from the Easy Boom. Aligning its receiver with the C-Stand's baby pin. Lower it into place. Ensuring the extension arm is positioned over the largest leg of the C-Stand for increased stability. With the Easy Boom in the horizontal position, tighten the tension knob to ensure it's securely attached to the C-Stand. Verify the Easy Boom is in the horizontal position and its locking pin is securely installed. Slide the counterbalance track runner to the end of the track furthest from the center column. Align the rivets at the top of the weight bag with the three thumb screw holes on the counterbalance track runner. Secure the weight bag to the counterbalance track by inserting the three thumb screws into place. Do not over tighten. Use weight plates to match your equipment weight plus an additional 3.2 to 3.5 pounds for optimal counterbalance. Locate the weight plate bracket and loosen the knob located at its base. Do not fully remove the set screw. Slide the counterbalance track runner to the Easy Boom's tail end. Position the weight plate bracket so its arm faces the right side, then slide the bracket onto the tail end of the boom. Align the two holes in the center of the weight plate bracket with the two pegs on the counterbalance track. Once aligned, lower the bracket onto the track. Tighten the knob at the base of the weight plate bracket to secure it into position. Insert one counterbalance thumb screw into the thread located between the two pegs on the weight plate bracket. Store the remaining two thumb screws in the unused set screw holes on the counterbalance slider. Place sufficient weight plates onto the weight plate bracket's arm to properly counterbalance the equipment you plan to mount. Locate the weight plate clamp, open its lever, and slide the clamp onto the weight plate bracket's arm until it sits flush with the mounted weight plates. Close the lever to secure the clamp onto the weight plate bracket's arm. Mount your light head to the Easy Boom using the 5 8 baby pin. Tighten the light's tension knob to secure into place. Wrap the included safety wire around your light's tilter bracket, above the handle or another secure area. While supporting the Easy Boom's tail end, Press the release button on the locking pin and pull it away from the center column. Store the locking pin in the plastic cap located on top of the center column. Slowly remove your hand from the Easy Boom. A properly balanced Easy Boom should maintain a horizontal position without the need of any additional support. Using the weight plate bracket's arm, slowly move the extension arm up and down to reach your desired position. Locate the extension arm's tension knob on the Easy Boom. Loosen the knob by rotating it a one quarter turn counterclockwise. Never rotate the tension knob more than a half turn counterclockwise, as this could cause the extension arm to detach from the Easy Boom. Using the handle, slowly rotate the extension arm to your desired position. Once in position, rotate the knob clockwise to tighten and lock the extension arm in place. Do not over tighten. All right, everyone, that's it today for the Easy Boom. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below. And as always, thanks for watching.